Hello and welcome to this video of Facile English, Unit 5, Lesson 1. Facile English is directed by Teacher Salvatore, with whom you will learn native English in a practical, easy way and at your own pace. Let's study with Fe. Let's study with Facile English. Facile English. What you will learn. Unit 5, Lesson 1. Introduce someone. Possessive nouns, possessive adjectives, and grammar practice. Introduce someone. Vocabulary. Relationships. 1. A classmate. 2. A friend. 3. A boss. 4. A colleague. 5. A neighbor. Okay, let's repeat them, please. A classmate. A friend. A boss. A colleague. A neighbor. Possessive nouns. Ms. Garcia is Mary's teacher. Mary is her student. Possessive nouns. Examples. Joe Brown is Lou's friend. Ben's colleague is Rose. I am Miss Mary's student. We are Tom's neighbors. They are Raul's classmates. Possessive adjectives. She is his boss. He is their classmate. We are her friends. Bill is our boss. Andy is her neighbor. Possessive adjectives. Here we have the subject pronouns which we had seen before. We have I, you, he, she, it, we, you, and they. These are the subject pronouns. And we have, okay, now we have possessive adjectives. Okay, these are not pronouns, they are adjectives. But they function the same way as the pronouns do. Okay, I would be my, possessive, my, you, your, he, his, referring to she, her, it, its, we, our, you, your, and they, or they, it would be their, possessive. So these are adjectives. What is the difference with the pronouns? Well, these are adjectives, and what always follows an adjective? Well, it's always plus a noun. Always plus a noun. And the nouns are people, places, things, and or animals. Okay, here we have grammar practice. 
circle the correct word or words, of course, in your mind. Number one is, are they or there, Judy and Andrew. Which one is it? Perfect. We need a subject. Are they, Judy and Andrew? Number two, is Mr. McCoy, you, your teacher? Well, we have the word teacher, so we need a possessive adjective, possession. Is Mr. McCoy your teacher? Perfect. Number three, Mr. Smith is I or my colleague. The same thing as number two. We have colleague, which is a noun, and it refers to possessive, possession, my. Mr. Smith is my colleague. Number four. Is she or is her Linda? Yes, we need a an object pro a, a subject pronoun. Yes. Is she Linda? Number five. Which one is it? Perfect. Are you Raul's friend? Perfect. The subject pronoun. Number six. Mrs. Jones is? Yes, Mrs. Jones is my doctor. Number seven. He's an engineer or his an engineer. Here we had, remember we had seen this pronunciation of he's and his, which comes from the throat. Okay, so it's a glottal stop. His. Okay, but in this case it's he is, he's an engineer. Okay, number eight, Joe or Joe's, and Ben's classmate is June. Well, yes, it is Joe. Joe and Ben's classmate is June. It's the same for both. So Joe and Ben's classmate is June. Number nine, yes, we have Mr. Lopez is Carl's neighbor neighbor. So we need a possession. We have Carl's neighbor. The neighbor of Carl. Okay. And number 10, in this case I put a zero. I forgot the one. But we have Jimmy's. Which one is it? Yes, Miss Rose's student. Perfect. There you go. Okay. And remember to subscribe Give a like if you like the video and tap the bell so you won't miss any of my videos. Remember, practice is the key to mastering any skill. Brian Tracy. Fuzzy English appreciates your visit. My best wishes. Until next time.